It's time for the final round of the 2024 Six Nations. So as always, I've fired up EA Sports Rugby 08, my favorite rugby video game of all time. We will be playing this massive final matchup for the wooden spoon between Wales and Italy. It will be coming to you live from the Principality Stadium. Who's going to come out on top? Will it be Wales who have had an iffy campaign to say the least? Or Italy who have already picked up some good results? Who's going to come out on top? Let's get into EA Sports Rugby 08 to find out. Hello rugby fans and welcome back to the channel. Today, as mentioned, I'm here on the GOAT EA Sports Rugby 08 to start recreating the final matches in the 2024 Six Nations. And what a huge one to begin with. It's the battle for the wooden spoon. We've got Wales at home to Italy. Going to be a blockbuster matchup for sure. I'm really not sure which way this one's going to go. And of course, stick around into the second half when I will give you my score predictions for this game who do i think's gonna win who do i think's gonna unfortunately take away that wooden spoon like i said it's gonna be a really really interesting match italy have shown glimpses particularly in the draw against france wales have lost all of their games but of course put in some okay performances with a younger squad and they are at home so you'd think they would have that as a slight advantage but of course Let's get into EA Sports Rugby 08 now, uh, modded up to include the correct kits and teams thanks to the fabulous guys over on the Rugby Forum. Bigger kicks it away into the Italian half straight away. So yeah, head over to the Rugby Forum if you want the up-to-date kits like you can see here. The only downside is the roster is a couple of years old because that takes a lot more work to change. But we've got some good players in there. We've got the game faces. We've got the correct kits. And I'm really looking forward to seeing how this matchup goes. Williams again goes deep to Dan Bigger. Lovely jink inside from him. Rollins, Bang! Look at that. He just ran straight through. A little bit of a sidestep. A couple of sidesteps. Really fooled the Italian defence. And over he goes. Rollins with the first try of the game. Wales will seriously be happy with this so far. A cracking start. Bigger to convert the extras. With the ball. Flicks it out to Bigger with the drop goal. Wales get another three points on the board courtesy of Dan Bigger. Five metre scrum. Lovely from us. Scrum, really working wonders. Can. Oh, the ball's gone back inside. Have we got it? Have we not? Yes, we have. Williams. Bigger. Fairly easy for him. Lovely move from the scrum. That is Wales' second try of the game. Not sure what those Italian defenders were doing. They've just let him walk through, basically. And then Bigger will convert his own try. Should be fairly simple. Straight through the sticks. Williams gets it out to Zamet, who kicks it away for half time. I mean, it's not a bad kick, really, either. Italy have been all over the shop in this first half. Injury, substitutions, and Wales are 17 points to zero up. Good first half for them so far. So let's start this second half bigger to get things underway. Everything's going according to plan for Wales so far. 17 points to, good, to the good against this Italian side who you thought would have been really, really up for this. Of course, as we get later on into the second half, I will give you my score prediction for this game. Tipperick picks it up. Josh Adams, a little bit of silky skill from him. Fend off, Josh Adams dives over for Wales' third try of the game. They have come out absolutely firing in this one. Italy all over the shop making mistakes, injuries, substitutions. Dan Bigger to kick this one over 
and to almost wrap up victory already. Beard, lovely inside pass to Marin. He's away, and there doesn't seem to be anyone there to stop him. Marin goes over for the Italians' first try of the game. Is it too little too late? It was a fantastic score, you have to say. Sloppy from the Welsh defenders. They're celebrating. I mean, come on, you've got a bit of work to do now. We've got an injury in the prop department. Francis, see if Italy can nail this conversion to go seven points clear. Up he steps. So what do I think of that? this matchup in real life? Wales versus Italy. I mean, uh, Italy have put in some real glimpses of good performance in this Six Nations. And I would love nothing more than them to beat Wales and really back that up. You know, particularly the draw in France, which they should have probably won that game. I just think Wales at home are going to be a little bit too strong. They themselves have shown glimpses of quality. Of course, they've got a young rebuilding squad. Um, I just think being at home will be that be-all and end-all. I mean, I'm in a win-win situation here because I'm predicting a Wales win. But if I'm wrong, then I'm happy because the Italians have won. So, yeah, I'm going to go for a Wales victory. And I'm going to say 21 points to Wales and 17 to Italy. So I'm going 21-17. I don't think it's going to be a walkover by any stretch of the imagination. And it's a match I'm really, really looking forward to. Both teams are going to be really up for it to try and avoid that wooden spoon and finishing bottom of the Six Nations. Let's see if... Oh, they were coming back for the advantage. Let's go quick penalty. We've got another advantage. They clearly were not out of the way. Can we score some sort of last point? Let's see if Bigger can finish the Six Nations with a bang. No, he doesn't. He completely <laughs> fluffs it and the drop goal goes wide but there we have it Wales have won this matchup on Rugby 08 really can't wait for this match in real life as I said a few times it should be a really good game the Wales have come out on top in this will they in real life who knows if you've enjoyed today's video please do drop a like I'd appreciate it leave a comment down below give me your thoughts and predictions for this game of course if you haven't already that subscribe button as always I'll mention the Rugby Gaming Network Discord server fabulous place to grow the rugby gaming community if you're someone who wants to take that next step uh, lots of chat and talk over there and if you've liked today's video then why not check out this one on screen now it's my rugby champion six nations series as england if you've enjoyed today's video then i think you'll also enjoy that one so check it out thanks a lot for watching